Hello everyone, today I'm going to let you hear the difference between the Electrosonics DPRA digital plug-on transmitter and a hardline XLR input with the same microphone and same source. Let's go ahead and get right to it. Okay, um, let me go through the setup. It's quite simple and give you guys the opportunity to listen using an A, B, and or color-coded system on the screen. Um, to start us off, we have a Shep Cement 5U inside of a Rycote number 7 Zeppelin with a little bit of wind protection. It's not that much wind out here right now. To start us off, we have a Shep Cement 5U inside of a Rycote number 7 Zeppelin with a little bit of wind protection. It's not that much wind out here right now. Hard line down to a whirlwind splitter and one of the outputs of the splitter is being sent to Electrosonics DPRA. Hard line down to a whirlwind splitter. And one of the outputs of the splitter is being sent to Electrosonics DPRA. And the other channel is then going hard line into the Sound Devices Mix Pre 3 here on my belt. And the other channel is then going hard line into the Sound Devices Mix Pre 3 here on my belt. Um, I am also recording on the 822, which is what you are listening to uh, for the DPRA demonstration. Um, I am also recording on the 822, which is what you are listening to uh, for the DPRA demonstration. And I am also recording obviously to the Sound Devices Mix Pre 3 from my XLR hardline. And I am also recording obviously to the Sound Devices Mix Pre 3 from my XLR hardline. I'd be interested to know any differences that you're hearing between the DPRA and the hardline XLR source. Also keep in mind that you can download the 48K 24-bit version files at the description below. Please subscribe for future videos on this channel and I'll look forward to seeing everyone very soon.